Well, this is very tense. Hello YouTube, or should I say Merry Christmas YouTube, Conductor165 here, and as you saw from that very creepy intro, we're talking about the cause of mayhem on the railway, the troublesome trucks. So first off, these are based off the Hornby plank wagon, I'll show the screen now. This is one I do actually own, but I don't currently have in reach because I forgot to pre prepare for it. However, as for information on, this in on these trucks, should I say, they were first produced in 1990 for the Wind Up Hornby collection. Now I do have a Wind Up Hornby Thomas, which I will be talking about at a later date, which will be in the vote at some point. And this is the box for it. As you can see, it's pretty much the exact same thing, near enough, but it's got a different coupling system to what these have, which I'll talk about this later. Then these trucks were released in 2001 for the Hornby Electric variation, which is what these are. They have insulated wheels so they do not short out the track and they're basically for just standard model railways of today. And they were discontinued in 2014, but were then re-released in a double pack in 2015. Now I did a bit of research because the site I normally use for my research did not have much on these. And I found that these came in four different boxes, apart from the wind-up one which I've already showed you. There was the solo box. A pack with Percy, which included Percy and the Troublesome Trucks, which I didn't know that was a thing, but it turns out it is. There is the Thomas set, which included Hornby Thomas, Annie Clarabelle, and a set of track. But it allows Thomas to do shunting with trucks or coach work, which was quite a nice feature by Hornby. And there is this pack, which I'll be talking about today, the Duo Pack. I'm sorry that this image is a bit blurred, I couldn't find a decent image of this. I do not know what day they were discontinued after 2015, however. Now, as most of you might not know, I know um, if in the Thomas fandom a lot of people do know, that there is actually other troublesome trucks as shown on screen now. These were based off smaller Hornby trucks and had printed on faces, whereas the ones I'll be talking about today have moulded faces. And Hornby did make a box wagon and a standard truck with these. I do not currently own any, but I do plan getting some in the future. Right, that is all the history on these trucks. Now to talk about these. Now, I don't know which order they are, but there's truck 1 and truck 2. I don't know which one's which. Let's talk about this one first, and you'll notice compared to the other one, the face is dramatically smaller. But it's one of those iconic faces, I believe it's in Trapmaster. I'll show a screen now, the closest one I can find. But what gets me is that it's very square compared to this one. This one's more rectangular to fit a bigger face on it. I don't get that, but nonetheless, one thing I don't like is that there's no red buffer beams and there's no actual hook for real train connection. So that means these were just made to be standard toys at this point. However, one thing I do like is the amount of detail on the side. There is a lot of lines and planks visible. It just, I feel like there could be a bit more. You got the underneath there too. That says Hornby Railways under there. Which way up is it? I did it right the first time. There you go. Hornby Railways. Made in China. So yeah, there's not much to talk about these. They're just box standard trucks. Just with faces. And there's no point in me going over this one because it's just the exact same thing. And it's, oh, let me just read what this says. 2015 Galane Thomas Limited. You can see for yourself right there. Very hard to see, but it is there. And Hornby Railways are made in China once again. So yeah, like I said, this was the duo pack and it has the date to prove it. Now, because of how small this information bit was, you're gonna get to see a running session with these and you'll notice a few changes on the layout for I'm game ready for a special Christmas video which will be uploaded on Christmas Day. So if you're excited for that, subscribe, like, check out my Instagram and Twitter where you will be seeing a few secrets or sneak peeks of this upcoming Christmas special. So yeah, thanks for watching, enjoy the running session, Merry Christmas!